Hi my friends, I am still in Holland and in a few days I will stay in uh, Hobbitain that is one really big shop here in Holland uh, and now I am walking to the uh, Overloom Museum so come with me and let's see what uh, we can find inside if something has changed or not you will see in the end of the video so let's go Hi friends, uh, one more time in another museum, this time I am in Oberlon, here in the Netherlands, South Netherlands, in Holland. Uh, this museum, Oberlon, um, was very interesting when I visited uh, for the first time 10 years ago, more or less, and I was surprised because the, the collection was incredible, was really huge, full of uh, Second World War vehicles, mainly Aliens. Uh, American, British, and very rare things that you cannot see in others. Uh, and very well conservated. Uh, but this time, after 10 years, I expected um, uh, like a, a more vehicles and even more planes. And I was right in on one side. Uh, I found, for example, a, a B-25 Mitchell, a Dakota, um, and more aeroplanes, a Spitfire, I think. Uh, but in another hand, I was a bit upset because uh, they removed all modern vehicles. All modern vehicles. Uh, ten years ago, I was able to see um, Shilka, BTR, um, I remember some 255 and, and others, many, many modern vehicles from the Cold War. Uh, but today I was looking around and I was not able to find it and I was a bit upset. Uh, many of those vehicles that you can see was the same than 10 years ago, it's okay, uh, maybe something new, for example, the Churchill, um, uh, Cromwell, or, or vehicles like that. But in general, I think that the museum has lost um, power no? or importance because half of the museum was modern vehicles and now just disappeared. So I was a bit uh, frustrated. No? Uh, they organize also the museum in a different way. Uh, it's more interactive, more um, for all kind of people. I mean, if you are visiting the museum with the family, it's okay. But for the people who like the tanks uh, or in general all vehicles, I think that um, it becomes a bit uh, more like a um, exposition, no? that uh, you cannot see the vehicles around. And I can understand it because most of the vehicles have many accessories, weapons, ammunition, many, many details, the radios. Um, so I understand that they don't allow to walk around and to touch it because, uh, it's, uh, for example, this, no? uh, you cannot, <laughs> it's normal that they don't allow you to, to be close to the vehicles. But um, I recommend you uh, to come here. Yes, if you are close to any of your destiny. For example, if you go to the Scale Model Challenge or if you go to Amsterdam by car, then it's okay. If not, uh, I don't recommend to come here exclusively for the vehicles because um, you will be a bit disappointed if you are used to Bobington or if you are used to, to Seymour Museum. So that's all uh, from Holland. Um, 
I expected something more, but uh, mm, my sensation was not good. So my next trip will be to Germany. I will go to, to the Munster Museum. I have been in the Munster Museum many times. Uh, um, I will see if uh, there are something new or not, or everything is the same. So that's all about this museum. It's, mm, it's a pity, it's a pity that they have missed all the modern vehicles and they organize in a very strange way. No, I don't know. I don't know. If you can hear or if you have visited this museum recently, please uh, post here the comments and let me know what is your opinion. No? Maybe you think like me or maybe you have uh, a different opinion. So that's all my friends. This is Mi Jimenez from Holland. Bye bye. Guys, I am right now outside the museum. Uh, even outside, I remember a long time ago uh, to see a uh, Joseph Stalin II, I think, uh, that was here next to this T-34. But now it's only the T-34-85, and that's all. So pff, a bit boring. I, 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 get, I am getting even more and more disappointed. Fortunately, I was able to buy this uh, ammo box. Uh, that was nice, only for 12 euros, so maybe I can keep some tools uh, inside. That's all my friends, bye bye! <laughs> Discover many more videos on our YouTube channel. Don't forget to like, subscribe and activate notifications. Thank you for watching.